Banner hospitals are at capacity as cases of COVID-19 rise. In fact, some locations are already reporting more than 100% capacity. News 4 Tucson's Mark Mangura joining us live with new information from Banner. Mark. John, in December, bed occupancy rose by 150%, and it's up nearly 300% since November 1st. Now, right now, patients with coronavirus make up nearly half of all hospitalizations in Banner hospitals. Now, to manage the large increase in cases, Banner hospitals are using rolling diversions to keep one single hospital from being overwhelmed. Now, this means that patients may be sent to a different hospital than they would be at normally in order to balance how many patients are at any given location. Now, this is important because the average stay for COVID patients is three to four times that of a non-COVID patient, according to Banner. And a new remote monitoring program has allowed some of those patients to return home to recover, which also helps open up space at hospitals. Additionally, Banner says that they will pause all elective surgeries starting January 1st. Marjorie Bessel, the chief clinical officer for Banner Health, says that they need Arizonans help with more mitigation and better decision making to slow the spread. Please shrink your circles to include the fewest number of people possible. Colleagues, friends, classmates, neighbors, grandparents and other extended family do not belong in your circle. Bessel also asks Arizonans to not host or attend New Year's Eve celebrations with the holiday coming up this weekend. We've got you covered. I'm Mark Mangura, News 4 Tucson.